Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this message. So today I'm here with a channeled messages reading from your person for all of my Libra placements out there. So if you have Libra as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this message might apply to you. Your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in communication, in separation, at a distance. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person and you'll know. Before I get started, please keep in mind that this is a general reading for all Libra placements out there, so it might not relate to you specifically, and if it doesn't, please don't take it personally. So let's get started with some messages from your person. I don't give second chances. Your hugs are the best. Can we come back to this? Okay, so also keep in mind that this could be you or your person's energy, but so far I feel like your person could have done something. I feel like this is more your energy, but then again, it could be your person's energy, but someone in this connection cares about the other person but at the same time one of the two out of the connection kind of did something to betray the other's trust and I feel like it could be you saying I don't give second chances and you're like firm on that but then again it could be your person um, because I feel like we replacements, they try to see the good or like they try to look at things in other people's perspectives. Um, but this person could have wronged you in some way, um, but they still hold a place in your heart that you're like, maybe time will heal this. So you're kind of still you still have this connection on your mind. We have your hugs are the best. Um, I feel like you feel very good when you're around this person physically. And that that's what makes it hard to kind of, if you were to cut off this connection, it would be hard for you. So right now in your mind, or your person's mind, um, they could just be doing their own thing maybe there's no communication right now because they're trying to mend this whatever happened they're trying to mend it over so they can come back to this connection there's so much on my mind oh my a double rainbow I can't wait to express my feelings. Okay, so yeah, um, this person is hoping that with time things will get better between what may have happened with this connection. Um, like I said, this could be you as well, but um, they're contemplating because I feel like in their heart they want to come back to this connection because it's not they're going against, I don't give second chances, but to them it's like, I don't wanna lose this, so. And they don't just wanna jump to that conclusion of just cutting you off or you cutting them off um, right after one thing just went bad. Because this connection is rare to them, the double rainbow this connection sticks out to them and yeah also you could have seen it I know summertime is approaching for most of us but 
you could have seen like a double rainbow or just something like along those color tones. Um, you might be wearing tie-dye or um, just something rainbow related. But this, this connection is rare to this person that they just don't want to pass it up just because something wrong happened. Um, we have, I can't wait to express my feelings. Um, I feel like this person is gathering their thoughts so that they can approach this in a healthy way so that you two can come back and try to work things out. All right, let's get your last three cards. You give me hope. This is forever. I'm scared of being vulnerable. Okay, so yeah, this person is working up the courage to discuss whatever issue there is. I feel like this is the type of person where they're very stern and strict on their boundaries. They're not used to giving second chances. Um, it could be that they've been very giving before and for them, it hasn't really worked out in their favor. They always get played in the end. Um, but with this connection, it gives them hope because this is different. They feel like this was a minor slip up and they're hoping that this, that whatever mis miscommunication happened, they're hoping that they can trust themselves to still be in this connection because it's worth something to them we have the infinity sign this is forever you could have like a tattoo of this but basically this person wants this long term they feel at home with you and they feel like this is a lucky connection um and they're willing to work things out they're just scared of letting their guard down because of what what has happened in the past for them. So yeah, um, I'm feeling like this could be your energy, Libra placements out there, but then again, it could be your person's. But yeah, that's all I have for um, this reading today. Thank you all for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye.